The following message is transmitted at the request of the United States Geological Survey. At 5 a.m. Pacific Daylight Time, a 10.0 magnitude earthquake has struck Seattle, Washington. This could possibly trigger the Yellowstone supervolcano to erupt, but it can't be confirmed at this time. Stay tuned for more information on this developing situation. The following message is transmitted at the request of FEMA. A volcano watch has been issued for the Pacific and Mountain time zones. This means that a volcano eruption is likely within the next few weeks. Stay tuned for more information on this dangerous situation. This is a national emergency. Important details will follow. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Department of the Defense of the Republic. This is not a test. Repeat, this is not a test. The Yellowstone supervolcano is expected to erupt within the next 12 to 16 hours. If you are within a 500-mile radius of the volcano, evacuate now. These states, in the U.S. are, Idaho, Wyoming, Montana, Utah, Eastern Washington, Eastern Oregon, Northeastern Nevada, Northwestern Colorado, Northwestern Nebraska, Western South Dakota, and Western North Dakota, and the following provinces in Canada, Southeast British Columbia, Southern Alberta, and Southern Saskatchewan. If you are in these areas, evacuate to the East Coast now. The following cities will have shelters, Augusta, Maine, Manchester, New Hampshire, Montpelier, Vermont, Boston, Massachusetts, Hartford, Connecticut, Providence, Rhode Island, New York City, New York, Albany, New York, Trenton, New Jersey, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, Charleston, West Virginia, Washington, D.C., Baltimore, Maryland, Richmond, Virginia, Roanoke, Virginia, Raleigh, North Carolina, Charlotte, North Carolina, Asheville, North Carolina, Charleston, South Carolina, Columbia, South Carolina, Nashville, Tennessee, Atlanta, Georgia, Savannah, Georgia, Macon, Georgia, Montgomery, Alabama, Orlando, Florida, Tampa, Florida, and Miami, Florida. Evacuate to any of the listed cities. Stay tuned for more information on this dangerous situation. This is an update to the previous alert. If you are within a 500-mile radius of the supervolcano and have not evacuated, it is too late to do so. The volcano will erupt in 30 minutes. Prepare to face certain death. The following message is transmitted at the request of the National Weather Service. Since the eruption five days ago, multiple strange weather patterns have been taking place. 
tornadoes with 400 mile per hour plus winds in the Midwest, 120 plus degree temperatures in the North, and sub zero temperatures in the South. The National Weather Service issued excessive heat watch number 237 for the entire New England area. Temperatures will exceed 120 degrees Fahrenheit, or 48 degrees Celsius. As a precaution, drink plenty of water, and stay in an air-conditioned area. Stay tuned for more information. The National Weather Service issued Winter Weather Advisory No. 158 for the entire Southeast. Cover up in blankets and coats, and drink hot beverages. Highs will be in range between 10 and 25 above zero, and lows will be 5 to 20 below zero. Stay tuned for more information. The National Weather Service issued a tornado warning for the entire Midwestern U.S. Get to a shelter, or an interior room in your house. Stay tuned for more information. This is an emergency action termination. The volcanic ash has cleared, causing the weather patterns to cease. You are free to exit your shelters. But if you are within a 100 mile radius of the volcano, stay where you are. You may not have a home to return to, and some volcanic ash is still on the ground but will be cleared. Your government thanks you for your cooperation during this emergency. All programming may now resume.